I'm leaving Alexandra Library now on MacDonald Boulevard, heading down, de heading south, and in about another 200 yards, I'll come to the road junction and uh, we make a swing up, take a left here, which will bring us up to Main Street in uh, the township of Alexandra. I'll just ease out myself here slowly. Behind me is a yellow bus, whether you can hear it or not. And I proceed now <clears throat> in an easterly direction, making my way slowly to Route 10, otherwise known as Lock Hill Street, which is the main drag towards Quebec and Glen Robertson. And uh, I'm just approaching the lights now at Main Street. No doubt you can see signals in front of me. Now proceed straight through over this main street here and uh, pick up one of the back tracks, missing out the traffic in the town centre, which at the moment is quite heavy uh, for this place. It's a beautiful day as you can see and uh, there's quite a lot of people out and about. The temperature is around about 25 Celsius and um, it's really a really lovely day. Now the light has changed to green, I'll proceed forward, uh, heading towards the back road, and uh, on the right we're just passing the Knights of Columbus uh, headquarters, coming down to the stop sign on the right there, you can see it, where I shall swing a right hand. to wait for this, uh, oh it's turning left, right, so now I'll swing out of here and uh, ahead of me now you can see possibly maybe able to make out on the left hand side of the screen St Finan's Cathedral, the spire reaching up into the sky there, maybe you can see it there, it's beautiful, beautiful, I'm just coming to a stop now and uh, because Finnan's Cathedral is on my left hand side. Forward now and uh, passing the cathedral just, just now. Passing. Proceeding in a southerly direction again. There on the left is St. Finnan's Cemetery uh, Chapel where the bodies are laid to rest during the um, winter season when the ground's too hard for them to dig the graves that we left there till, uh, till the spring, you know. I'm now coming up to another stop sign. I'm afraid there's lots and lots of uh, stop signs around this area. I'll just ease down. And now here we go. Away we go. Away we go. The left hand side is a nice little a little home there with the Canadian flag flying very proudly. I'm just coming up to a giveaway now, and well, it's a stop actually, making a left hand when possible. Just waiting for a little bit of traffic. This is Lockheel Street, otherwise designated Route 10. Route 10. And, uh, Proceed down Route 10. This now is a straight road all the way now for about uh, 10 kilometres uh, uh, to, to Glen Robertson. So we'll just uh, take it easy. We're just coming out of Glen Robertson now and uh, still a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day. A super day. Nice day for a ride. On the left hand side there, where that big wagon's pulled up. Uh, is Alexander Mouldings, uh, the biggest employer in uh, Alexandra. Uh, obviously, it, uh, well, not obviously, but uh, it makes wood mouldings for uh, 
properties, you know, in turn one next to And there's bases in America. And, uh, as I say, it's one of the biggest uh, employees in the area. Spoil up now, we're just coming up to some heavy farming machinery. Rather a wide load, so uh, we'll just ease past this. And he's coming out rather a lot there. But uh, there we go, past it, safe and sound. But you've got to be careful around this area of farm machinery. As you can see on both sides of the road now, uh, they're just fields and agricultural land. Um, it's a big farming community. And, uh, on a nice day, it's, uh, it's nice to be around here. But in the winter, it's very, very bleak, very bleak. So, we're, we're doing all right. Now, we're proceeding in an easterly direction. If we were to carry on on this road, where, where we turn off, where our home is, um, in Glen Robertson, we stop, of course. But if I was to go straight ahead, in about um, five kilometers, no more, you would be in the province of Quebec. Province of Quebec, that's eastern Ontario, and then into Quebec. So we're, uh, uh, we're heading towards the French Quarter, as they say, so uh, we have to get the phrase book out from time to time now to understand uh, what they're talking about. Do we stay like this now till about next uh, north, till about November? As you can see, the road is just straight down, very, very straight, not too wide, but just nice. And as you can see, there's not much traffic around. So, uh, we're doing about um, 95 kilometres an hour, which is, uh, I'm afraid, 15 kilometres over the speed limit. Speed limit being uh, only 50 even in these on these country roads. They're very cautious here about speed, and uh, many many people are stopped on this road by traffic cops. They seem to take a pleasure in uh, treating this road as uh, an easy catch for motorists. Maximum 80 kilometres an hour. down a yellow one just at oh, right ahead of the probably kilometres ahead of us at the moment. We're proceeding in the, towards us obviously and uh, it's a school bus. Uh, all the children here are conveyed uh, by these yellow buses to their respective schools unless their parents can take them uh, in their own cars. Most children seem to go by uh, public transport, but it's not but it's public transport paid for by the council please. Uh, we've come up a little bit of a rise here and uh, right ahead of us now I can see some hills about, oh, it's, it's a fair way away but it's like, quite visible by the naked eye, probably not on the camera. Well these are the, uh, the foothills to the Quebec uh, mountain range, the Laurentians I think it's called the Laurentians. And, uh, Red car there on the left, so right, sorry, on left. Somebody wants to sell. If you want to buy one, that anybody in Southport wants to buy a red car, supercar, it's uh, it's near Glen Robertson in Canada. Yeah. A lot of prices, but it'll be a lot cheaper than the computer. Yeah. Lovely trees, nice, you know, Christmas type trees, you know, but they look like they want some lights on so. It's only a couple of weeks here since the snow uh, disappeared. And 
yeah, look at it now. Two days ago it was 31 degrees Celsius. Today it's a hovering around about 25. So it's super weather. Absolutely gorgeous. On the right hand side here is a, uh, quite a large pond. That's a nice, nice time the front of your house, isn't it? Very nice. Bit of fishing, sailing, boating, whatever. And then the winter it acts as a good ice cream. We're making good progress here. The railway line's on the left hand side. That's the main line between um, Ottawa and um, Toronto, I would say. Get you there anyway. On the right, we have a small sugar shack. Exactly sat at the edge of the uh, field of the woods. And a small sugar shack. Green roof, nice place. Two or three new houses here, or bungalows, just recently built within the last three years. People walking in, cleaning the road. It's one way to do your sunbathing and working at the same time. We're just entering the, um, the township now of uh, Glen Robinson. Um, and the speed limit drops down to 50, so I'll have to decelerate a little bit and uh, Welcome to Glen Robertson. Welcome. Well, this is Glen Robertson. It's a very small French, mainly French community. Uh, uh, only six miles from, less than six miles from, uh, from the province of Quebec. Uh, and, uh, you can see it's mainly consists of all very old properties. But some of them are very well kept. Church, church on the left hand side here. And the only shop in the village there, basic needs. And on the left hand side is the only cafe restaurant. That's Linda's. Glen Roadhouse. And this is where I uh, pull in. This is our establishment. So that's the end of my little trip. And uh, I'll just swing the car around. And then we're ready for. Uh, Ooh, and then we're ready for going back later on today. So thank you very much for taking me company there, and uh, you have all have a nice day. Thank you very much. Bye bye.